everybody, welcome back to the Chaotic Little Book Corner. My name's Acacia. I've missed you guys. I was gone for a week, which was weird, but I needed the time. So I did that, and now I'm back, and I'm very happy to be back. And I'm going to start with a happy thing. So first of all, we have this. This is for you guys, but not yet. It, it'll be opened on the 1st of December. I'm excited. But until then, we have this. This is called Blue Spider's Attic, and it is a Magic of Used Books. So this is a subscription box that I plan to be receiving monthly if I'm absolutely in love with it, which I'm sure I will be. And it is, I believe, two used books and some extra goodies. I'm really excited. I found them randomly signed up, and I'm very excited to see how it goes. Yay! Oh, kind of bad at that whole undoing this box thing but you know that's fine uh, oh oh okay that works we'll do that la 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 hmm. I need something sharp but I have nothing sharp Opening a box up. Open. 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 Okay. Ooh. So first, I see the note. The note that always happens. All right. So, this is the October is for nostalgia, specifically of the childhood variety. This theme was chosen because of the fondness and simplicities of days gone by, and sometimes it's nice to have a flashback of the good old days. This month's attic box will take you back to the mornings parked in front of the TVs with Saturday morning cartoons and munching on gigantic bowls of cereal. Um, so inside this box will be three gently used books, one sample bag of coffee, um, one... Oh! The rest of that I won't tell you about. And I'm very excited. So first, oof. so this is Captain Marvel and Carol Corpse. This is a episode one. That's kind of cool. I don't usually pick up episodes, but I'm curious to see how that goes. Then we have this. This is a bookmark. Now, what it is made up of is the M words from the dictionary. So this is goes from... Muckus to Multiplex. So that's kind of cute. I like it. It's very thin, which I really enjoy. And then we have some super 90s stickers. Just like super 90s. And then what else do we have? So then each book is wrapped, which I'm all for because it means gift time. So this is Richard II, and it's by Shakespeare. Interesting. Oh, wow. Like, it is, this is interesting because this book actually, so this is Richard II, and it is actually really annotated, which I'm not opposed to because regardless of the fact that it's super random, um, I really, really like that it's so annotated, and it's... I'm really curious and I'll have to write Attic and ask them if it's annotated by them or the people that used it post them. So that's not a bad thing. And then we have this. What are you? I do love their tape because it's kind of colorful and pretty. So that's, that's super nice. What are you? L.E. Modest Junior Flash. This 24th century Earth has been ravaged by an ecological catastrophe and recovered. The survivors enjoy a world of plenty, even the poorest and abundance of the upper class. Ten years ago, Jonnet quit the Marines after witnessing an atrocity interesting this is usually not the type of book that I would have on my shelf but I'm willing to give it a shot and then we have ooh, a light roast from Boyers I can't smell it 
through the plastic, which is a bummer, but that's okay. That's okay. And then we have, oh my goodness. I got a random magic card. It's from Drudge Reavers and it's a creature. It's a skeleton. That is hilarious. I kind of love it. It makes no sense, but it's fabulous. That's like really ridiculously cute and fun. I'm sure the magic crew will be very angry at me for calling their stuff cute, but I think it's kind of cool. This is a little Wonder Woman figurine, a DC comic figurine, and this is just interesting. I just wasn't expecting that. So random. I kind of love it. Like, I actually, okay, I don't kind of love it. I really love it. Ooh. These are handcrafted treasures by the Blue Attic. So these are these, these are magnets. And these are little magnet pins and they, <gasps> they're He-Man pins. Oh my goodness. I see. So there's the Cobra Commander and He-Man and, oh, it's, it's all sorts of 90s stuff. So there's some Ghostbusters over here. Let's actually take you guys out of the package. So we've got some Ghostbusters over here. We've got some Zelda down here. That's just really fun. And there's some Ninja Turtles in there. Garfield, Dragon Ball Z. Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. Fabulous pin stuff. Oh my god. So this is one of the 20 sided dice. I've never had one of these in my life and it's green speckled. It goes with the magic card. I know it goes with the magic card and I'm just like, that's pretty funny. And then there's one more book in here. So let's see. And then you get little, um, Oh, okay. So you get little cards talking about each of the um, brands that sent you an item. And then the Electric Omega wearable art, crystal stones and clays and creations and unique gifts on Etsy. They send you a little, they sent me a little 10% off coupon. I'm going to link, oh, oh. Okay, falling. I'm going to link the uh, attic box down below so you guys can go join them, go see what they're about. I think this is really worth it. Um, I'm really enjoying it. I honestly want to say it's $27 after, oh, it's $27 after shipping and handling, and I'm totally down for that. This is the last thing. This is... This is like Buffy stuff. This is Wild Things, a, cro a chi Chicago Lamb vampire novel. Since Merritt has turned into a vampire and become the protector of Chicago's Canningen house, it's been a wild ride and she's the master vampire. Okay, this is like some old school fun stuff. And it's blurbed on the front by Charlene Harris who wrote True Blood, which I actually really enjoyed. So this, I'm, I'm looking forward to this. Just, this is going to be one of those books that I'm going to definitely have on my shelf for a day when I am not feeling up to pa on my feelings of life. I'm really happy with that book. Um, with that book box, it's, it's definitely more random. It's definitely a little bit more of a, just be ready for whatever kind of box and it is a lot of used stuff and a lot of just random gifts I like that I think it's a lot of fun and it's a completely blind box because it's personalized to what you tell them you like I'm a hundred percent down for it I will definitely continue to work with this box I will continue to subscribe to this box um, I'll link everything down below and I really hope to work with the Blue Spider Attic group again. Um, 
Did I get that right? Yeah, I did. Blue Spider's Attic. Um, I'm hoping to work with them because this is this is something really fun and different and I really enjoy it. It's not like every other subscription box, which is so nice. All right, guys, I will talk to you guys very soon. I love you all. I hope you're doing well. I will in the next week or so address the video that came last week. That was a little bit of a meltdown. Um, I'm still processing I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do and how I want to move forward because in my mind I need to decide if this channel is going to be a fight channel or a calm channel. Um, if you guys have an opinion, let me know. I don't think this is going to be a fight like 24-7, but I want to know, do you guys want me to continue to talk openly about my feelings on what the current political stuff is like do you want to hear my thoughts on that or would you rather this be a safe haven um i'm up to either but i need to keep processing and keep thinking and i need to keep feeling out what i feel comfortable with um all of your opinions are taken into consideration i want to thank you for your support and your love and your your kind words and thoughts i definitely want to stay with this channel. I'm not leaving. I'm not going anywhere. But I need to figure out what direction this channel is going to be because I can either fight or I can be a sense of security. And I'm not sure which way I want to go. Um, it can be a mix of both, I'm sure. But I need to, I need to think about it. So I will talk to you guys soon. I love you all.